Yet another country has just announced that they're ditching the US dollar for trade. And here's why this impacts everyone. For almost 80 years now, America has enjoyed the power that's come with being the world's reserve currency. Not only that, but because most of the world's commodity trade is denominated in US dollar, it's given the US huge global economic power. To put it bluntly, if another country doesn't see eye to eye with the US, they have the power to unilaterally hit a country with sanctions, causing huge damage as far as throwing their economy into a recession. Look at this chart, for example. In 2011, the US placed sanctions on Iran's oil industry, which massively dropped their exports for years. Sanctions were then lifted in 2015 and exports exploded doing wonders for their economy, only to have them reinstated again in 2019, sending them crashing to new lows. And because the world heavily relies on the US dollar, not many countries want to get on America's bad side and follow Iran. However, here's where things get interesting. Because Russia and China are now leading a growing amount of countries that desperately want an alternative. China and Brazil announced today that they'll be ditching the dollar and now will be trading in their own currency. Currencies. Russia recently agreed to use Yuan as their main reserve currency. Longtime arch rivals Saudi Arabia and Iran stunned the world when they announced that they were restoring diplomatic relations. A deal brokered by none other than China. India are making efforts to move away from the dollar. And China is even trying to convince Saudi Arabia to sell oil in Yuan instead of US dollar. Which if agreed to would be the biggest move yet. As a world reserve currency, the US dollar isn't going anywhere soon. But if more and more of the world's trade is settled in other alternatives, we might just be witnessing the beginning of the end for America's global influence. So the question is, do you think this would be a good or bad thing for the world?